Saturday, January the 4th, the Lockheed Martin Armed Forces Bowl. It's at 10.30 a.m. on ESPN in Fort Worth, Texas. You got Southern Miss. You got Jay Hobson against Tulane and Willie Fritz. Now, this, I think, is going to be a fun game. This is a an old Conference USA rivalry. Um... Southern Miss seven and five, Tulane six and six. Tulane played the much more significantly strong schedule uh, at Massey. Southern Miss had the number one hundred ranked strength of schedule, and Tulane had the number fifty five. Uh, yep. Both teams like to turn the football over. That's a little bit of a problem. Um, Tulane averages point three three giveaways a game, and Southern Miss averages point five eight giveaways a game. So. Like I said, neither one of them real good at, uh, at at getting turnovers. On the other hand, uh, Tulane, I think, is just the <laughs> way more significant, uh, uh, talented team, et cetera. The line is Tulane minus seven. The total is 56 and a half. Tulane, number 16 in rushing yards per attempt this year. Southern Miss is number 115 in that aspect. Uh Southern Miss on the other side, they can throw the football. They're number 12 at 8.81 yards per attempt. The issue is they don't throw it that much. So I, I'm i rolling Tulane here. I'm rolling Tulane minus seven. I'm going to go under the 56 and a half. Uh, I don't think that these two teams are going to be able to score. Like that 56 is 28 to 28, right? I think Tulane shuts this team down on defense. And maybe I'm crazy for that. So. All right, so we'll we'll be a little together, a little apart here. Um, I'm going with the wheels. Uh, I got Willie Fritz. I got Will Hall, and uh, and I think this is one of the best young offensive combos in college football. Yeah. I, if these two guys were coaching bigger, better athletes, four star dudes, it would be unbelievable what they're capable of. They're at an, uh, uh, a high-level ac- academic institution in Tulane where recruiting is just not as easy. Plus, they're in the heart of SEC country. Yeah. So, and then when you, and the kids don't go to the SEC schools, they go to all the other big Louisiana schools that are massive in football. I mean, this is like the fifth best football program within a, you know, a 100-mile radius of them. And yeah. And – and it makes it tough. These dudes are crazy smart. They're crazy sharp. This offense has been far more explosive than anything I thought before the season started. They went from a triple option football team to a power spread team, which is insane to me. Just just yeah. wide open, let her rip. How you took guys that were recruited to run the triple option and were able in one season to be able to get them to change identity. Well, it wasn't just once. Like, this has been a, a work in progress, but – but Will coming in really like, yes. okay. fired it up. Yeah, These these guys are great. I think they're going to put up points. I think Southern Miss is going to put up points. I think Southern Miss does have a decent offense, and, and they've got a really good coaching staff. But I think the separation between – if Tulane was in, in Conference USA, I think Tulane has a really good shot at winning Conference USA. Okay? They were 6-6 six and six in the American. They're one of the top two teams in Conference USA. There's the difference. I think they handle them. I love – I'll lay the points. The points don't scare me at all. Um, I kind of think I want to go over here. Okay. So over because 56 I, and a half. I, that, I mean, it makes sense. Score, and, and, I, and I'm not afraid of Southern Miss scoring some. Okay. Okay. No, I, I'm with you there. I, I can I can totally see where you're coming from. Uh, so over 56 and a half, and we both like Tulane, and I've got the under. So let's, uh, let's wrap up. Let's do this. 